This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this uh, Monday, the 8th of May. We're looking at the Dow at this 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Down 28 at 33,644 after a huge move up on Friday. A couple of things uh, were really attached to that gain. Uh, both it was some really good surprised earnings to the upside, Apple moving, short squeeze. But I think there was new buying, and that's the reason why I think that you cannot consider this as one of those sessions where you're up huge on the Friday and then Sunday night into Monday, you just give back a big chunk. <clears throat> this is different, I think. And we're looking at the S&P. Now, this is interesting. Remember I talked about the S&P, the nine-period moving average. It, turned, it went, actually, we're not short anymore. We got two, two cup profits and ran on Friday. <clears throat> That nine period moving average went uh, negative just for one day, back to green. That's good, but it's in the inside track repellent zone. We'll see what happens down just three points at 41.33. Looking at the QQQ, which that was where the strength was on Friday, broke your new recovery high, actually uh, an over a year high. Um, it's about 17 months or so high. It's down one at 3.21. Uh, this is still very good action. Looking at the QQ IWM, the IWM is the Russell 2000, giving back some of the intraday gains today already, down 20 cents at 174.24. Starting to improve a little bit. Ha, gold. Gold is up a seven at uh, 2032. Dollar can't get out of its own way. Down again, down 10 ticks at 101.11. Uh, looking at high grade copper, high grade copper right there. Having a nice bounce today, it's up 0.04. I wanted to look at uh, the bonds. We'll go to the TLT. <clears throat> TLT is down sharply. So yields are going up. TLT is at one at 103.73, down just over a dollar. <clears throat> it's within that range. Remember, I spoke about that 200 period moving average being a magnet in the 105, 106 area. Let's just go quickly to crude oil because crude oil is at a really strong rally. Looking quite good today. Let me just check this out. Yeah, today's up $1.53. Uh, hit the uh, nine period moving average uh, resistance. We'll be back in a moment for the Tiger Traditions Hour and check out my opening call daily newsletter. And of course, my video is now uh, up. This is the, uh, the webinar that I did last week.